Good morning guys. Welcome to my office again here on Kopangan in Chalaglam Bay on this beautiful beach. Today the video yes is a little bit later. Why is the video a little bit later? Because it's Mother's Day. I wish all the mothers out there a beautiful Mother's Day. I hope your kids prepare this beautiful breakfast on your bed while you wake up and gave you some beautiful presents because that is what we always do uh, with our family we wake up and the kids prepare breakfast i do some shopping for fresh fruit and all that stuff and then we bring breakfast on bed while we give her some small presents uh, mostly the kids paint something beautiful uh, or write a poem or whatever and then we give it to the mom and then we make this day a special day this is how it should go always and but as usual the kids will always end up in a fight somewhere during the day where mother needs to intervene and then she will say oh you ruined my mother's day <laughs> no we are not a perfect family it's just like everywhere else guys um, but we love to um, give my wife their mother some extra attention on this beautiful mother's day which was founded by Anne Jarvis, I think, in 1914, and then it was taken by the President Woodrow, and he made an official day of it, the second Sunday of May, which today is the 10th of May, two days before the halving. Yes, speaking about the halving, guys, no, the drop yesterday was not the halving. We still have two days left to the halving. The price drop yesterday was about 15%. So let's say from 10K to 8.5K. This was expected a little bit, so as you know, because if you have seen my videos, I told you guys, yes, uh, we if we zoom out, we can go up, but like in the short term, we can have a small pullback. This was a pullback till now. So we have seen Bitcoin dropping to eight and a half K eight thousand six seven hundred is now hovering around that amount which is a really cool amount for Bitcoin to hover around because you know that just shows that Bitcoin still has some power left to you know stay around the 10k and to um, make and prepare itself for a run-up after a post halving dump so the post halving could even lead to another dump like it did the last halving as we could see in the chart you can see that uh, just two days before the halving in the last uh, halving we had a small price drop and then after the halving we had a little bit more price drop but the most important thing you need to learn from this is that these drops after the halving were the last drops and dips you could accumulate bitcoin before the bull run so whatever happens if Bitcoin drops even more after the halving, just realize that this can be the last dip before the huge bull run. So I would accumulate a Bitcoin a little bit more now, and if it dips a little bit more, I would accumulate a little bit Bitcoin again. Because that's what I said yesterday. If you, uh, if you manage your portfolio in a good way, you always have this amount of um, stable coins aside, to buy the dip so nothing happening nothing extreme Bitcoin is not going to zero we are not going to see the huge market crash this is just a healthy pullback after like a 140 percent pull uh, run up uh, we only corrected like 15 percent so I think there's uh, nothing to worry one very cool fact um, I think it was stated by a good friend of mine Willy who I met him here on this island Kopangan we had an amazing time Till now, our markets were mostly also run by the miners because the miners, they were like bringing like 1800 Bitcoins to the market in daily. So now after the halving, the miners are not bringing 1800 Bitcoins anymore to the market, but 900 Bitcoins to the market, or they could bring those Bitcoins to the market. So instead of 1800, now they can bring 900 Bitcoins to the market. And then if we compare these with the exchanges, then the exchanges now will be the biggest Bitcoin distributors because they have a daily revenue of about 1200 Bitcoins because of the fees they make of trading. So now these exchanges become big players in the market because they are able 
to put 1200 bitcoins daily up to the market while miners now only can put 900 bitcoins to the market i think this is a very good conclusion uh, willy Wu made but we will see what happens because i think it's very important to know who the big players on the market are thanks willy for this amazing amazing analyze so guys i don't have um i don't have more to say today i will as i promised i will keep it as a short video as possible because it is mother's day and on mother's day we give our mothers uh, I sadly don't have a mother anymore, but she will be, be very proud looking down on me from heaven. But we will treat my wife as the mother of my kids because she is. <laughs> what a stupid conclusion. And give her some extra attention and, you know, do all kinds of nice things today for her and with her. Maybe I will even end this beautiful evening with giving her a very nice massage. The conclusion guys, don't worry about a thing, Bitcoin is going to do fine, just focus today on your mothers, give her an amazing day, tell her you love her, tell her you miss her and all the moments you can't see her, and you know, tomorrow is another day, and tomorrow when we wake up, you will see again what Bitcoin has uh, done at that point. Please zoom out. Don't be too stressed out and focus on the short term. Zoom out, look at the big picture and realize that the dip after the halving is the last dip you can accumulate Bitcoin before it will start the huge bull run. Yesterday I tweeted by the way um, that if you don't have anything to do today or you are going to do groceries or you are going to do whatever, put one of my playlists from the Bitcoin Family YouTube channel on play while you leave the house because we need some more watch hours to start to monetize our channel and we want to monetize our channel so that we can share the profits again with some poor people all over the world i wish you guys an amazing day together with your mothers and i hope to see you tomorrow again please like the video subscribe to our channel try to hit the bell button so you will be notified on every new video i make thanks for watching have a beautiful day, live life to the fullest, enjoy your day, see you guys tomorrow, bye.